Hi, good people. It is Valentine's Day. Isn't it? Yes, it is. Right. So we just happened to find a nice hotel. We're sitting down doing some work. We're actually making a break, having a glass of red wine today. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, what a perfect opportunity to talk about Earth changes, right? Schumann resonance, you know, timeline shifts, dimensional changes, you know, the usual stuff. film I just wanted to um, talk a little bit about earth changes uh, because when I coach people when I train people I really want to talk about stuff that's not common knowledge uh, if I'm going to help someone I need to help them on a level that's uncommon and with that I mean that we need to dive into information that goes a lot deeper and broaden your uh, horizon your perspectives your understanding of life uh, your body your your spiritual self, uh, what's going on, what's really going on on the planet. Okay. I wanted to talk about that and connect it to something that you can actually look into that's been measured on the planet and that's been monitored. And I'm talking about the sun, uh, the Schumann resonance, and also something called the Global Consciousness Project that you most likely have not been uh, looking into or heard about before. The Schumann resonance is actually um, it's a resonance. It's a bounce, bouncing of energy between the uh, the um, Earth ground and the stratosphere high up in the in the um, in the sky. It comes from the thunder, lightning and thunder, and when lightning shoots down as it constantly does all around the planet, creates electrical charges, and uh, this creates a bouncing resonance of energy. And it bounces from the ground and up and ground and up to the stratosphere and down. And the human resonance comes from it comes from a, a German scientist actually, Winfred Schumann. He discovered that the Earth has this kind of a pulse. It's a, it's been called the Mother Earth's kind of heartbeat in a way because it was a it was one constant frequency. It was seven point eighty. I can remember 0 0.82, 0 0.83, something like that, and it's been, just been uh, constant um, at all times until suddenly now, until a few years ago, it started to change, it started to go up. So suddenly, the human resonance is not constant anymore. It's not 7.82. So something is happening. Something is changing, and something is causing the human resonance to shift and change. And the human resonance have been measured now to peak way above 30, 33, 34, no 36 actually, is, yeah close to, I can't remember, 36, 37, 38 maybe even, way above 7.82 at least, so something has been going on and something is changing, so so that's that's why uh, it's been talked a lot about the human resonance and um, probably being connected to the changes on the planet, so look it up, it's interesting something is happening. The Global Consciousness Project was started by a guy at the Princeton University in the United States. Uh, the project was uh, set up by spreading out uh, 50, 60 small computer boxes. It's basically kind of a computer. It was called Random Event Generators. It's just boxes generated, generating random numbers, zeros and ones, spread all around the planet. And uh, what they've seen is that when there's big events going on on the planet, these numbers are not random anymore. They start to be more coherent, generate more zeros, generate more ones, and the data changes. That's something you should look into. How do you experience the timeline shifts that are happening on the Earth right now? For me, yeah, timeline shifts can sometimes be experienced out of nothing. But I've been having a few, um, I've been having a few actually, no, I've been having many, just at home, many uh, situations when I get up in the morning and it's like when I go up to the window um, and look out, I, you know, 
turn open the the blinds and I just get you know the next day in and like uh, you know a couple of days ago I went down to open the door and to just look out get a feeling of uh, today's air and suddenly it's like I stop up I freeze up and I sense uh, I don't know where I'm, what I what I'm sensing and how or how I do that but I sense in a way that something has shifted and I it's like I'm even even um, telling myself I look out and I I am breathing the air and it's like hmm, hmm it's like something has shifted something is different today that's what I that's what I say sometimes and um, I had uh, a moment like that yesterday I went out in the entrance to open the door to get some fresh air in and suddenly I stopped up and I noticed wow well, what's what's going on or hmm, something has shifted again and then I don't think any more about it and I go about the day and uh, I can start to see other signs um, and um, variations of something that seems different in my everyday reality. That can be with people I, I know, uh, friends, family, you know, events going on on planet. I can com combine it with looking into what's going on with the sun, the Schumann Resonance, the Global Consciousness Project. And um, that way, you know, you start to see variations and, and changes. Um, from every day, from from day to day, and um, you can notice, you can just notice some days are different. So that's how I notice. That's how I see it. Sense it.